what's up guys and girls how are we all doing welcome back to Pemberlin now we've got some moody skies over here I'm a little bit concerned as you can see over there we've still got the straw still on the ground it's ready to bail now it really is but I need before I do anything else I need to nip I think um, just around the back of this barn here there was a um there's like a, a bit of a bit of a bit of land that um i have uh, cut and um windrowed up for uh grass now what i need to do is i need to drive down as you can see there look i need to drive down to the shop um in the i'm going to take the new holland i think um i need to drive down to the shop pick up our um, loading wagon which now has um, it's had some new blades fitted so that's ready for us to now go and pick up and I just need to come down collect that with the loading wagon and take it down to the sheep I need to feed the sheep the problem is I've got to go all the way down to the shop pick it up come all the way back load it up with grass and then go back back to the sheep before I'm hoping them those dark clouds I'm hoping they don't turn into anything um, because uh, this is as you know this is um, I've got I've got no backup I've got no backup supplies um, so if this all goes horribly wrong then I am gonna have to spend out money and actually buy get some get some grass and some um, hay bales and some straw bales from from another farmer or or something so um, but we will just have to wait and see how it all goes I think but um, I'm hoping I'm hoping that that that, that cloud is either gonna pass or just not turn into anything so here we go we're at the shop the good thing is it's not far it's not far from from the um or far to the shop or back to the um back to the yard or field should i say well, we need to go in here lovely job so they said they'd left it where we where we left it so they've just pulled it out of the workshop and left it there which is awesome look at that so we have some new blades down on here so that'll help us to um, help us to pick up which is awesome and um, they were getting they were getting a bit a bit blunt so we've um thought it'd be best to spend out the men the money to have that done right let's get this back <laughs> it's getting so dark if that rains now I'm gonna be good trouble is with this also it's not I can't get out before that dude walks into my trailer there we go um, I um, there's no cover for this um, for this trailer so even if I manage to get it collected and even if it does rain it's still gonna get wet or damp between here and the sheep so but we'll just fingers crossed guys fingers crossed that this turns into nothing it goes by we don't want it we don't want it that's probably the worst the worst looking cloud I've ever seen but it would just be nice to get just to get some get some food down for the sheep the um the cows are also going to want grass I'm, I'm i'm hoping that i've got enough to do both um but we'll just have to wait and see worst worst case scenario we can we can give the um 
we can give the sheep um, hay instead of grass. So um, we will see. What I'll probably do is I'll just give them uh, one load. So we'll see how we'll see how much see how much grass we get off this um, off this cut here actually. Right, so let's get over the top here. There we go. Now let's lower you down. Turn you on. I think everything's good. Go away, you nasty cloud. So this is all lovely and dry now. This is the problem we are having. If it rains now, it all turns to mush. Which is not the greatest thing at all. I think what we're going to do here, I think what I, what I'm going to have to do, as long as the cows, as long as I can get the cows some, some TMR, we should be good. Where are we looking here? Um, if I do one headland here. There we go. Awesome job. Right. Let's now try and uh, pick the rest of this up. There we go. Right, this is this is going to be one whole load. So, but we've got we've got another got another field which we can we can mow up if we have to um, I'm, I'm hoping I'm not going to need to um, but we should we should be pretty good I've got uh, if I can get this down to the sheep get them some water as well I'll feel I feel a lot easier a lot more at ease Over here. Oh goodness me! Here we go. See, I'm start. I'm starting to rush and I'm missing bits. Just need to calm myself down and not stop. Just stop worrying so much. Like I said, worst case scenario, we'll we'll go out and we'll buy. We'll have to purchase. There we go. Right. Well, we are nearly, nearly full. The last two little bits there can go to um, will go to feed the cows so they've just got something before the um, before the TMR so right now let's um let's get this down to the sheep yard and uh, let's get them fed I'm gonna put some lights on you know it's getting a bit <laughs> it's getting a bit dark no happy not happy with that. There we go. Right. So, how's everyone been? Anyway, I hope I hope we're all well. It's um it's becoming a busy time on the farm here at the moment. Um, just with getting getting everything ready and getting everything together and just avoiding this nasty weather that's on the horizon there so but I hope everyone else is well um, sheep are down here so I do know the um right now this this bit of road here 
always causes a few problems. We take it nice and steady around here. We need to get as close to that as possible. We can come round with the trailer. Lovely. And then we use as much of this area here as possible. Let me get around there. This is going to be difficult to get anything bigger through there. That waterfall is so loud. Right, so let's get this up to the sheep and get them fed. Just be up here on the left. Here we go. There's our feed trough there. Let's go in here. Right, now, I think the best thing for me to do here... Let me just quickly hop out. Um, I don't really want to drive in. But I don't see myself having much options here. Um, the turning circle there is a bit. But we just have to make sure that we're careful on... Um, not to mince up any of our, any of our lamb. As I said, they don't they don't like to move. We have the most unscared sheep ever. So right then, let's see if we can unload here. Um awesome job now let's go on sheepies off you go off you go go and get yourself some nice nice fresh woo there nice fresh grass there we go and you have stood in exactly <laughs> the worst place possible I'm hoping we can get around there quickly like that. Straighten her up. Make sure we miss this post here. There we go. That is the sheep fed. We do need to get them some water. And zero, zero sheep were were harmed in the making of this video, which is even better. And we have still got some grass left in the trailer for us to go and put down at the cows now. I want, I want to get the sheep done because I weren't sure how much that was going to, um, how much that was going to take. Um, but in future, I think what I'm going to do, because I'm. Because I'm trying to rush this at the moment and trying trying to get them fed, that's why I'm doing it from the loading wagon and just dumping it into the troughs. Um, because I want it done and I want it I want it in. Um, in in future, I will end up baling it um, or baling some grass or hay and taking that down and leaving it stored at the sheep. Um, and then all, all we have to do is just go down with a with a set of forks and. Um, throw it in the troughs and uh, that will be done um, but as I said I'm kind of sort of panicking a little bit at the moment so hopefully now that we should be good so that's one one set of animals done so now we need to go and give the cows the rest of this
and um, we also need to head on and get some we need to get some bailing done but what I might do is I might do a separate a separate vlog for that I think so this one will just be just sort of getting get, getting some getting some grass up and um, we'll do another one with with the bailing I think so it's um we should be good I need to bail up some um, um some, I need to bail up the straw and the hay and uh, bail up some grass as well so we'll be good I'm pretty sure we'll be good right so TMR is going to go straight in the in there so as long as these have got some food to eat I will be like I said I will be happy we're not going to get a huge production off them but they will have something to feed on rather than just feeding off the um, off the the grass in the meadow because that is getting to a stage now when you know they need they're gonna need the extra stuff there we go so we can dump that in there there you go they've took all of that they have took all of that so I think guys and girls that's 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 something I'm happy with that oh I'll tell you what I've got to do and do you know what we'll do that in this vlog as well I'm gonna dump this here just gonna dump that like so Now we need to do some watering. There we go. All right, let's just leave that filling up there. So yes, as I said guys, um, this is where the TMR is going to go. So, but we need to actually get into here now, so I just, well, I just thought I'll come around here and open the gate. And um, over there we need to put some, um, put some water in that, in that water trough there. And then we also need to take some down to the sheep as well. There we go. Awesome job. Let's get back in. Perfect. Oh, blue skies. Look, it's going over. It is going over. It's slow. It is slow. But right, that is that. Done. Mine out in the way, cows. Thank you. So, right, we need to hop out here. Let's close that. So they've got some food. And they have some water. Perfect. Right then, guys, what I'm going to do is I am going to shoot back to the sheep to get those watered as well. I'm not going to bore you with, with that journey once again as I was a bit silly and I should have done that in the first place so go okay. well, we're gonna fill that up so guys for now though that is going to be it from me I do hope you have enjoyed and um, in the next one as, as I said we're gonna get some um, we're gonna get some bailing done in the next episode so guys but until then Thank you ever so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, share the video, subscribe to Gamer Dragon if you have not done so already. And um, I will speak to you all in the next one. Cheers for watching, guys. Take care.